EA Sports welcomes you back, along with Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski, set to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. Ray, it's all evened up, but not for long when this one is finally settled here tonight. No, huge game in the series. You want to get yourself into the lead. You want to be aggressive, not timid. But every player knows the importance of this contest that's about to begin. Both these teams look ready to go, as does the official. Let's bring it on. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. Slides the puck to Hamilton. Pass back to the point. Off a stick. Salamaki's got the puck along the wing. Drives it to the crease. Oh, what a block. He'll get a pat on the back from the coach when he gets off, if he can get off. Nice pass. Takes the feed. Here's a chance. Colorado's got the puck. Battle along the boards. Trying to get back on the attack now. Anderson's lugging the puck. Sends a pass over. Picks up the puck in his own end. Bailey's taking it from his own end. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Takes control of the puck. Maintains possession. The Eagles take it across the blue line. Handles the pass into the middle of the ice. Great defensive effort with the strip. Grabs the puck here in the neutral zone. The Comets take it along the wall. Denies him! And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. We're still scoreless. Scoops up the puck off the draw. Official's arms going up in the air. He caught that hook, too. Gains the zone through center. Here comes the official's decision. The Comets have been called for hooking. As soon as he stops skating, he has to reach out with his stick. Parallel to the ice, it's going to get called most every time. The Eagles will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. I, for one, am a big fan of when the power play gets on the ice. I used to make my living doing this stuff. And it's because you've got time, make sure you find a way to score. Strong defensive effort. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. Gets it out of his own end. The Eagles will play the puck from behind the net. From the right side, takes the pass. Puts it on goal. Stopped by the goaltender. The Eagles win it. Cuts to the paint. How do you miss that, Ray? I don't know, but we all do. You're right in the scoring zone, and you don't even test the goalie. And they get the puck out of harm's way. The Eagles scoop it up along the boards. Colorado's got the puck at center. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. He got all of that hit on the play. Makes the save. The Comets have it against the wall. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Look out, a two-on-one. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Grabs it in his own end. Gains the zone from the right side. Takes control of the puck. Excellent stick work on the play. Quick feed to Malone. The Comets take it across the line. Here's a chance, right in the slot, puts it in for the goal, and the rookie is on the board! What a nice way to jump into your first playoff year. You get on the board, and you can relax a bit. Uh, goalie burps up this rebound here. It comes right back into the shooting area, and the rebound is put away.
The Comets tally the game's first goal. When you get yourself into the middle part of a period, this is where the game starts to take shape, and now they've got the lead. Slides the pass over to Malone. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Colorado's got the puck in their own end. Sends the pass over. Takes the pass. Takes the pass from the left wing. Shot! Denies him in close. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, the Comets have taken a 1-0 lead. The Eagles win the draw. Back at the point, they set it up. Moves the puck, and he comes up with it. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Off the draw and a nice job locking up his opponent. Here's a short pass to Arsenal. No one home on that play. Keeps hold of the puck. The Eagles gain possession along the wall. Handles the puck. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Utica's in transition. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Colorado's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Stays with it. And he regains control of the puck. Manages to hang on. Nice defensive robbery with the stick. Utica's got the puck along the boards. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. He gets a piece of it with a stick. Past the halfway mark of this period, Utica's ahead 1-0. The Comets will go to work here in the offensive zone. Right to the middle! And now it's grabbed by Salamaki. Moves it quickly over to Timmins. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Right up front! Here he scores! Now you gotta keep one back. Trailing in the game, they get the equalizer. Well, he's got his head up, so he's gonna pick the spot here, and he goes through the legs. Goalies hate getting scored on in the five hole. The setters will glide into the dot. The Eagles win the draw here in the neutral zone. Puts it on net, denied by the goaltender. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Quick pass to Timmins. Time of the goal, 11 minutes, 20 seconds. Colorado's moving it up the ice. Puck battle along the boards. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Fails to find the open man. Utica's got it across the line. Takes the feed. Colorado's got a hold of the puck. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Utica's gained possession. Slides the puck over. Moves it to Malone. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Takes the feed from the left side. Referee signaling for a penalty. Looks like we got a hooking call coming up. Let's see what the official makes for the final decision. The Eagles have been handed two minutes for hooking. You get caught when you don't move your feet. Now you've got to reach out to slow the player down. He's in the box. Rightly so. The Comets get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. Here's their first power play of the night, James, and they can be patient on it. They want to get the good shot. He scores, and the deadlock's been broken. Now you get a chance to control the pace of the game. It's tough to do it in a tie game. Now you've got the lead. A 
That's the good play. It's a goal scorer's play. You shoot the puck and follow your shot. He gets a little lucky that it comes right back to him, but he makes no mistake. Utica's been preaching better starts. They've got that with a one-goal lead, Ray. They've got the lead. It's in the first period. There's lots of game left, but their coaches are talking about staying on the front foot to be aggressive. Quick feed to tries. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. Receives the pass. Slides it across to Bailey. Nice zone entry from the right side. Here he is in front. Turns it away. Certain saves are more difficult than others. This one right from the slot is turned aside. The Comets gain control of the puck against the wall. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. Takes a bump and loses control of the puck. The Eagles will play it in their own end. Moves the puck to the attacking area. Here's a short pass to Salamaki. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offensive zone. Taken along the wall by McDonald. Salamaki's got it in the defensive end. And now he angles it across to tries. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. The Eagles play it along the wing. The Comets get a hold of the puck along the boards. Nice pass. Here's an odd man rush. Colorado's got control of it now from their own end. Utica's got the puck along the wall. Nice zone entry from the middle. From the point, looks to make something happen. That's blocked. Colorado's got a hold of it against the wall. The Eagles going to work on offense. Stick save. On the backhand, misses. No, oh, he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. Scrum along the boards. Puck picked up by Wagner. Pass to Dickinson. Dumped in and they'll go off. The Comets have it behind the net. Utica's got it in their own zone. Smart defensive play there. Takes the feed. Inside the final minute of the first here. Phenomenal save with the glove to knock it away. That's broken up in the neutral zone. Strong defensive effort. Hangs onto the puck. The Eagles have it now. Can't find his man. Utica's got the puck against the half wall. Grabs it in his own end. And that one's picked off. There's the horn ending the first period. It went back and forth, and it's a close one here. It's time for our hamburger bonanza. If the home team scores in the next two minutes, you can get a free hamburger courtesy of our arena. Both teams heading down the tunnels. We'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period. Teams are back at center ice, and we are ready to get period number two underway. Utica's won the draw. And now he moves wow. it to Berchi. Sorry to cut in, James, but that was a hit that cannot be ignored. Stop that one. And I can feel the boards vibrate with that hit. He slammed them into the wall. Lots of time left in this period. It's a 2-1 game. Hamilton's won the draw. Slides it back to the blue line. Moves it quickly over to Hamilton. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Sends a pass over. The Eagles will play it from the defensive zone. Fires it. Oh, what a stop. Well, I think we might be in for an anything you can do. I can do better sort of night. Yeah, this is starting to look like a game that can stretch out and end up in overtime. These teams are evenly matched. 
A quick flick of the wrist, and that snapshot beats the goaltender. He's in the low slot. He doesn't have much time to think about it. The Eagles have even the score here in this second period. We thought this was going to be a really good hockey game. Now it's tied up here as we get ourselves into the middle part of the frame. By number 25. The Comets played along the boards. Colorado's got a hold of it along the wall. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Beautiful feed up ahead from the right wing side. Maintains possession. Takes a shot. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. The Comets are on the attack. Gets a hold of the puck here in his own end. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. And he slides it quickly to Timmins. Moves it around along the half wall. Keeps hold of the puck. A little crash and a banging forces the turnover. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Utica's gained possession along the boards. The Comets grab possession to the puck. Grabs it in his own end. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. The Comets scoop it up along the boards. Not able to connect. Quick pass to McDonald. Across the line. Puck grabbed by Sherwood. Unleashes a cannon. That goes off a twig. Utica's got the puck in the defensive end. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. The Comets have it against the wall. Looking for space inside the D zone. Here they come. Moves it to Banks. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Gains the zone. Utica's got the puck behind the net. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Nice zone entry on the left side. A chance from the slot. Oh, a clutch save! Dangerous spot in the slot, and the goalie comes up big with the glove stop. Still lots of time left in the period. We are all tied up in this one. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Picked up along the wall by Dickinson. The Eagles gain possession along the wall. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Utica's looking to break out of their own end. Steps across the blue line. Here he is in close. Wicked stop by the goaltender. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. Tries to get the puck over to Anderson. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. And he makes the save. Utica's got the puck along the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. The Eagles walk the line. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Nice defensive robbery on that. The Eagles gain control of the puck against the wall. Here's a chance in front. Made the save on the play. Gets a hold of the puck from the right side. Birchie's got it in the offensive zone. With the stop. Can't connect. Quick feed to Birchie. Oh, and another big stop. Really good positioning as he makes the stop from in tight. Colorado's moving it along the wing. Jabs the puck away. Stays with it. The Eagles looking against the half wall. Puts it on goal. Misses. Get it on the cage. Make the goalie do something with it. Sends the pass over. Quick shot off target. Yeah, he's going to have to adjust the sights on that one. That thing's off target by a long way. Puck dumped in. Gilbert stick handling in his own zone. Here's a short pass to Sherwood. Great balance as he scoops it back up. Good hit. Angles it over to Stevens. Takes the pass. Quick shot. Stops him with the glove. A 
That's a dangerous scoring chance, but the goaltender makes a great save as he's able to snuff it out. More than half the frame has been played here. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Utica's won the draw, and they'll go to work. And that carries off a stick. The Eagles move to the offensive zone. From the point, they take control of it. Beats the goalie, but can't beat the post. Oh, that's so close. I love the chance on goal, but it hits the post, and the game remains tied. The official signaling for a penalty as play is called. Banks has been nabbed for hooking on the play. I guess at a certain point you got to let the guy go, but he worries that he's out of position, so he tries to slow him down with a hook. Pretty cut and dry call. The power play unit goes right back to work. Power play looks great, but they've got to get inside those defensemen, fight for a rebound. And the puck clears the zone. Off the left wing and into center. Slides the puck across to Anderson. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Puck moved back to center, forcing them to regroup. Regains control here in the neutral zone. Along the half wall with the puck. Can't connect! And they can't connect! And the puck leaves the zone. Colorado's got a hold of it against the wall. Gaining momentum along the wing. Slides the puck over to Sherwood. Manages to hang on. And that goes off a player. As the puck skips into the crowd to one lucky fan. We'll get a face off here on the ice. The centermen glide into position. Steps in and takes the puck. Trying to clear. And it's a small victory for the PK unit here. Well, it's their job. Get it down the ice. Get off the ice. Get some new people out there. Colorado's power play expires. Both sides back to even strength here. And we are still tied. Obviously a pretty important time in the game. The PK does a good job. Keeps this game tied. Here he is from the slot. Too much congestion. Blocks the shot. Malone's got the puck in his own zone. Oh, and a good heads-up defensive play. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Knocked away. The Comets take it along the wing. And he regains control of the puck. From the left side, takes it at center. Here's a shot. And that's stopped by the goaltender using his head this time. Well, whatever you got to do, I guess. Man, those guys are lucky the masks are as good as they are now. That save had to be a jolt. We get a look at it, you see it hits him right in the face. Here in the late goings of the period, we got a tie game. Colorado's got it in the defensive zone. Burroughs takes the puck, pokes it away to stay on the attack. And he handles the cross ice pass. Moves it quickly over to Perron. The Comets move it in. Moves the puck. Utica's got possession here in the offensive zone. Colorado's looking to break out. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Let's the wrister go. Oh, going wide. You don't get the puck dead center very often. He's got to capitalize. You wonder if that'll come back to haunt them. The Comets carry it along the wall. Shot blocked in traffic. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Grabbed along the boards by Bailey. From one point man to another. Quick pass to Merchie. Good defensive effort to poke it away. The Eagles take it along the wall. Slammed hard against the wall. That's a 50-yard dash in a 25-yard gym. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. The Comets take possession in the defensive end. Pins them against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Looks like we got a penalty coming up here. Handles the puck. Can't get it to go. Whistle blows, stopping the play. Pretty hard to argue the holding call on this one, Ray. Yeah, but he's trying to hold him for just a second and get away with it, but he got burned on it.
Takes possession of the puck off the draw. Both teams have gotten on the board, and this one has been pretty much a dogfight through the first 40 minutes as the period comes to an end. Present your ticket stuff from The third period is just moments away, and both Ray and I will be ready to bring you all the action here on EA Sports.
The moment of truth has arrived for both these teams. Third period action set to go. Colorado's power play is still intact as this period is now underway, and they take possession and makes the save. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. It's all tied up. Colorado's got it in the offensive zone. Here's a chance. Oh, how did he come up with that stop? Takes a shot, being stopped by the keeper. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Utica's got a hold of it along the wall. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. As a great older colleague of mine says, this is waffle boarded away. Play set to resume with the faceoff ready to go. The Comets win it in the defensive zone. Clearing attempt. And they get it down. Yeah, good communication. They talk to each other. They're in the right spot. They just clear it down the ice. Pass across to tries. Big play inside the defensive zone. They move the puck out of harm's way. Utica's penalty killers deserve a pat on the back as we are still tied. Oh, I really like the penalty kill there. They were on the same page almost all over the ice that entire power play. The game stays tied because of their fine work. Makes his presence known on the ice. The Eagles get a hold of the puck along the boards. Taken by Dries. Colorado's got it along the wall. Timmons and his coaches are on the same page. That page is get him back on the ice because he's having a big night offensively. Utica's got it against the boards. Takes the feed. Nothing doing on that. Nice poke check. Grabs the puck. Receives the pass. Forces the turnover. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. This one in front. Off the mark. Goaltender's in good shape. There's not much room at all there, and he ends up shooting it wide. The Eagles move the puck in the defensive zone. Nice pass. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Completely misses on the play. You don't even make the goalie work here. You've got to make him have to do something in the net. Picks up the puck in his own end. Malone's taking it from his own end. The Comets take it across the blue line. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Stick collapses. Oh, so frustrating. You're in position. You've got the shot. Your stick gives out. Utica's got the puck along the wall. Nice zone entry from the left. Pokes it away in his own end. The Comets get a hold of it. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Grabs it in his own end. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Pinned up along the boards. Trying to get back on the attack now. Colorado's got it in their own zone. The Comets going to work on offense. Overshot it. Sometimes the only place you have is up over the goalie's shoulder. Sometimes you airmail it. Can't catch up to the pass. From the blue line, they take control of it. Fires one on goal. Traps that puck tight into his chest. If you're going to make the save as the goalie does here, you've got to read the play and have the reflexes to execute the save. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And a solid job tying up his opponent. Sends it in deep. Utica's gained possession along the boards. Enters the offensive zone from the left. The Eagles look to start the transition game. Sends the pass across the ice. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. The Comets will play the puck from behind the net. Utica's playing it through the neutral zone. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. 
It's a 2 on 0 oh. Scores! Once he gets clear of everybody chasing him, now he's got his head up, and he finishes his breakaway beautifully. Oh, what an effort. He did everything he could to stop that, but he gets beat anyway. Coaches look pretty active down there. Ray, what are you hearing? Well, they don't want anybody to get complacent here. They've got the lead, and they want to push forward. As quick as you get the lead, you can lose it right back. The Eagles scoop it up along the boards. The Comets gain possession in their own end. Here they come inside the neutral zone. The Eagles get a hold of the puck in the open ice. And we'll get a face-off while one lucky fan gets a souvenir. Past the midway mark in this period, the Eagles are hanging on to this one goal lead. They'd love to add another. Utica's got a hold of the puck off the draw. The Comets will play it in their own end. Here's an offensive chance. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. The Comets will play it from the corner. That pass goes a little sideways. Salamaki swooping in on the attack. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Moves it to Anderson. Slides the puck over. And that goes off a player in front. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. Big time stop. Scrum along the boards. Brayovac's moving the puck through his own zone. Dumps it in. The Eagles have it against the wall. Quick feed to Sherwood. The Comets have it in the offensive end. Sherwood's carrying it ahead. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Moves it quickly over to Berchi. Oh, had a chance to make a nice move, and the puck disagreed with him. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. Bailey's lugging the puck. Moves it over to Berchi, and couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Berchi. From his own end, he picks up the puck. And now it's over to Bailey. Utica's moving it into the offensive end. The Eagles gain possession along the wall. Here they come up along the wing. Strong use of the body to force the puck loose. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. And a penalty is coming up as the play is whistled dead here. Sin bin bound for tripping. I always hated taking tripping penalties. It always felt like there was something I could have done better than that. The Comets once again send out their power play unit. The power play coach had a quick meeting with the guys before they went out to start this power play. They know the importance down by one. Puck move back to the neutral zone. 15 minutes, 26 seconds. Here's a chance. Great save from in tight. Yeah, he's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. Utica's got the puck along the boards. The Comets take it across the line. Takes a shot, and that's blocked away. Colorado's penalty killers get a hold of it. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. Utica's got a hold of it against the wall. Through center. Utica's got the puck against the boards. Fantastic save! Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Pins them against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Through center along the wing. Strong defensive effort. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Takes the feed. Feeds it on over to Hamilton. Excellent stick work on the play. Takes a shot. Glove save, and he handles it with ease.
That's excellent timing on that stop. They've got the lead. We're getting late in the game. You can't really give one up now. Getting into the later stages of this period, the Eagles are giving their fans something to cheer about as they lead it 3-2. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Nearing the final minute of regulation. Comes up with the stop. In the third period. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. The Eagles get a hold of the puck in their own end. Sends a pass over. Takes the pass. The Eagles take it along the wall. Takes a shot. Oh, and comes up with nothing on the play. He really could have put a nail in the coffin there. Leading by one. Another one would have made the ending a lot more comfortable. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. We used to call this the tic-tac kaboom. Nice move, but all of a sudden you don't have the puck. And it's a quick pass to Perron. The Eagles gain control of the puck against the wall. Maintains possession. Oh, he almost put him through the boards. Colorado's got a hold of it along the wall. Oh, he'll feel that one. Comes up with the stop. Colorado's got a hold of the puck. Wide open net, and that's blocked. Maybe a simple case of anything you can do, I can do better tonight, Ray. Absolutely so, James. It's funny how you can almost feel the pressure in the game as it's a 1-1 series. Now everything gets more and more critical. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. This series will continue on, and we will talk to you then. Good night, everybody.